I have a pair of two 16 gigabyte Corsair Vengeance RAM and they are very low profile. I don't know if you can tell how low profile they are, maybe, if, maybe from this angle, you can see they're super low profile. I had these Crosshair Vengeance sit under a Noctua NHD15 and fits perfectly fine. And even right now, as it sits next to this Arctic Liquid Freezer 2 360 radiator, see that 360 radiator right there, uh, these RAMs are just a perfect combination. Now they don't have RGB, they're not fancy, but they work, <laughs> they work very fast. These are the 3600 megahertz variety, but they also have a 3200 variety as well. And they come in different configurations. I have the two 16 gigabyte set up right here because dual channels does run faster than if you have four sticks of eight gigs. So I went with two sticks of 16 gig for a 32 gigabyte. And actually I'll take them out right now so you can see how low profile they are. The way this motherboard holds the RAM is only from the top. So you see, if I push right here on this little tab, it will reduce, remove the RAM. But be careful, I'm doing it one-handed. There we go. So that should push it out. And then from there, you can pull the RAM straight out carefully. There we go, carefully pulling the RAM out. And at the same time, there we go. Ah, okay, perfect. You see right down there, that one doesn't move. Only the top one moves. Interesting motherboard design, right? So you can take out the RAM just like that. And you can see here is the Crosshair RAM. The Crosshair Vengeance. DDR4, the LPX. Super slim profile. The heat seek right here. You have the heat dissipation on the heat seek right here and it does a really good job.